Yeah, we've been married for well, I think 43 years now and he was a maths teacher at Haderbury College. He hadn't been long retired when he had a massive brain hemorrhage. I was told that he would need to go into a, a nursing home full time. But I brought him home just to see, you know, what, what I could do and what we could do at home first. I didn't know anything about Banksia Centre. Uh, I wouldn't have known they existed. I didn't have any need for them up until that time. Well, I think all the staff here enjoy what they're doing and um, they're, they're proud and pleased to be part of this um, situation. They've been the best support. They would look after Ian nine to five, three days a week for me. And sometimes they would pick him up um, from my work. So I got to work at nine and they were there to take Ian for me. That was pretty amazing. He is relaxed when he's here now and he can come and, and have um, an overnight stay, a two night stay, and he copes really well now. And the programs here uh, challenge him in different ways. You know, I've come in to pick him up and they're doing a quiz and he's answering questions which, you know, really surprise me, but they're choosing questions that are part of his long-term memory. I think it's brilliant. I think they're always, you know, reviewing things that they can always improve upon, but the Brotherhood of St. Lawrence they are, they are understanding of the circumstances, of the situation, of the people.